Hi! You will need chickpea flour, also known as gram flour, some milk, some turmeric powder, which is a spice that you can find in the spice aisle, some almond oil, and a clean bowl and spoon. Take your gram flour, which is also known as besan and garbanzo bean flour, and take two heaping spoonfuls and put it into your bowl. If you take more, it's okay. You can always store it in the fridge for later. You should have about this much in your bowl. Now take your turmeric powder and take about half a teaspoon and add that to your gram flour. Like this. Now take your almond oil. I love my almond oil. Add about a spoon of almond oil. This one's a little more than a teaspoon, but a little less than a tablespoon. Just spill it in. Don't worry about mixing it yet. I love mixing things, so I just go right ahead and mix it. Now take your milk and add a tiny little bit. I have a lot of milk. Don't add all of that. That's too much. Now start mixing it. Keep mixing until all the milk is sucked into the powders. See how mine's a little dry? So I'm going to add a tiny bit more milk. You can add milk as you go along, but don't make it too runny. Mix it up again. This is what the consistency should look like. It should look like a paste, not too runny and not too thick. Like pudding. <laughs> Why do I always refer to food? Now take your mixture and start applying it to your face. I like to use my ring finger. Before you apply this, make sure your face is freshly washed. No makeup. Apply a nice even layer all over your face. Don't make it too thick, but don't make it too thin at the same time. Turmeric masks are often used in India for Indian brides who are about to get married. This gives them soft and glowing skin. A lot of you might know that this is also called BT. Turmeric has so many hidden benefits that we don't even know about. If you use it twice a week on your face, you can eliminate wrinkles and dark circles. Not only that, but it's great for preventing acne. I've been using this for a while now and I can honestly say that it's prevented a lot of breakouts. <laughs> Please don't mind the silly faces I make while I put this on. Be careful not to get it in your nose or in your eyes, because it really burns when it gets in your eyes. And it'll definitely clog your nose. So like I was saying, turmeric has so many health benefits, whether you're eating it or if you're applying it on your skin. The active ingredient in turmeric is curcumin. I think I'm saying that right. Which acts as an antioxidant. Applying this mask has been known for anti-scarring, pigmentation, blotches, and it also helps with eczema. If you want to know of all the health benefits of turmeric, check out my blog and I'll have a list of them there. Don't forget to apply some on your neck. And you don't need to limit it to your face either. You can put this on your body and it'll give you soft, glowy skin. <laughs> now this is a hot look. If you have leftover milk, you should probably drink it while you're waiting. I love milk. So much. I should have my own cow. It will start to get hard and you won't be able to move your face, but don't worry. Now wait 20 minutes. After 20 minutes, it'll get hard and you definitely won't be able to smile. See how hard it is? Now you're ready to be washed. Wet the mask with warm water. It's better to do this before you shower so that you can just wash it off in the shower. The warm water will make it soft again. Start rubbing it into your face. Do one side at a time and wash it off. Now we're squeaky clean. Once you dry your face off, you'll notice that your face feels so smooth, like butter. <laughs> For some extra goodness, 
take a cup of warm milk and grab your turmeric powder. Take about a tiny little amount like that and add it to your warm milk. Now stir it good. Stir it until it turns about like a highlighter yellow. Then you can drink it. It's not delicious, but it's really good for you. If you're pregnant, ask your doctor first. And that's it. See you guys later.